The process of mitosis. Each chromosome makes an exact duplicate of itself. The chromosomes then thicken and coil. In early prophase, the centrioles, which have divided from asters and move apart, the nuclear membrane begins to disintegrate. In late prophase, the centrioles and asters are at the opposite poles. The nucleolus and nuclear membrane have also disappeared. The double chromosome centromeres attached to the spindle fibers line up at mid-cell in the metaphase. In early anaphase, the centromeres split half the chromosomes move to one pole, half to the other pole. In late anaphase, the chromosomes have also reached their respective poles. The cell membrane begins to pinch at the center. The cell membrane completes constriction in telophase. Nuclear membrane form around the separated chromosomes. Mitosis is completed. There are now two cells with the same structures. They are called diploid daughter cells. In meiosis, the DNA strands thicken into chromosomes. Homologous or like chromosomes begin to approach each other. Homologous chromosomes pair to form bivalence. The centrioles divide and move to opposite poles of the cell. The bivalents duplicate to form tetrads or four chromatid groups. The nuclear membrane disintegrates, crossing over recombination occurs. In metaphase 1, the tetrads attach to spindle fibers at their centromeres, line up at mid-cell. In early anaphase 1, the tetrads separate and the paired chromatids move along the spindle to their respective centrioles. In late anaphase 1, the chromatids have also reached the spindle poles. The cell membrane begins to construct. In telophase 1, nuclear membranes enclose the separated chromatids. The cell membrane completes its constriction. The first meiotic division ends. There are now two cells, each with the same number of chromatids as the parent cell. Prophase 2 begins in the second meiotic division. Homologous chromatids do not duplicate, but merely separate. In metaphase 2, the chromatids line up at mid-cell. The centrioles and asters are the poles a spindle has formed. In anaphase 2, the now separated chromatids approach their respective poles. The cell membrane begins to constrict. Telophase 2 has been completed. There are now four haploid cells.